Hi guys, this is Toya from Planning and Teaching and welcome back to my channel. This is the first plan with me of 2018 in my brand new um, happy planner, mini happy planner. This is my personal planner. If you did not see me set this up, please go click on the card up above, the box right beside or the link down below and you will see me set this up. So let's go ahead and jump right in. All right, so up first, I'm just gonna pop out this week, you guys. It is 2018. Super excited about planning in this. Don't you just love the sugar and spice theme? Um, but I already had an idea of what I wanted to do this week, and because it was blue, it kind of worked with me. I wanted to do um, like a winter theme using these silver snowflakes. So I'm just putting them in random places like I usually do, and then I'm going to um, cut them and place them in different um, areas within the spread. What I also was showing you is that I love the fact that January is not over in the corner. Like in my previous mini planner, January was placed in the corner section, but now it's in the middle, and I like that a little bit better. So now I'm just cutting um, the excess off the sides of the um, stickers and then I'm going to place them down on the opposite page. So if you have not noticed, I tend to cut from one side and paste on the other side. That's what's just been working for me. And I love the way it looks. Um, silver is very hard to capture on um, camera. And for some reason, every time my hands go into view the lighting changes so i hope you guys can see i'm working on a new setup for my camera so uh, that may be why that is happening but hopefully i will have um, everything in place by the time next week's plan with me is up so anywho i have a few more stickers that i need to lay down and i'm just kind of filling in some areas that um i think it'll work and then i'm going to pull one up because i think it will look better um turned upside down so I'm gonna place that under Tuesday and there you have it I love the way that looks already um, and the pink in the middle doesn't throw it off at all so I have a few little bitties um, snowflakes that I'm gonna place in a few places um, and then that's all I'm going to do the next thing I'm looking for is a quote um, out of my quote sticker book of course it is one of my favorite sticker books I should have um, purchased another one but I didn't see one and I found this black and white one that had yesterday scratched through and tomorrow scratched through but today is on there and then um, in that box it says thankful for so I wanted to um, use a sticker that that I could say what I'm thankful for so that's why I placed today down because one of the things that I want to do this year is be present the next thing I laid down is a little Aaron sticker right there so that I can kind of indicate what days I'm going to what errands I need to run this week um, and also these little hexagon stickers from my sticker roll here and I believe it's the wellness sticker roll um, and I just placed two right there to kind of connect everything so I love the way this Okay, and I'm sorry that this is out of frame a little bit, but this is my trendsetter sticker book. I am looking for a full box to use, and this is the mini um, set. And I found this really cute striped blue heart, but um, one of my snowflakes was in the way, so I had to pull that up first and then lay that down and then put my snowflake somewhere else. So that's what you see me doing here on camera. And once again, it's still out of frame a little bit, you guys. I'm so sorry. I was up at like 2.30 recording these videos for you guys. So now you can finally see what I did there. So next up, I am just flipping through a sticker book and looking for New Year's Day. And I had to find one that was blue. And I wanted to make it festive, like with... Um, fireworks or something but I couldn't find the fireworks sticker if you guys know what sticker book that fireworks sticker in is in please let me know but what I did remember that in my trendsetter mini sticker book they have um like these little silver stickers that are um these foil like shapes and I thought they were so pretty and so I went in and found those and I placed those down after I found these really cute blue snowflakes 
So that's what you're going to see me lay down right now. There they are right there. Those gorgeous little geometric shapes. And they were so cute. And they went with my theme because they were silver. So I'm not too upset that I couldn't find that um, fireworks sticker. But I still am going to need it for the 4th of July spread. So you guys, if you know where it is, please let me know in the comment section below. So I moved one of those blue snowflakes and I laid it down at the bottom and I think it looks better that way But I love the way my spread is turning out it ended up being like this blue silver winter theme and I absolutely love it All right, so the next thing I'm doing is laying down um, another box down on Thursday just so that I can indicate things that I need to pick up from the store especially when I do my um, meal prep spread this week I want to make sure that I have all of my errands laid down and checklist done and I go back to work on next Monday so I want to definitely lay down a checklist on Saturday so I can get things accomplished um, before I have to return to work and then um, I'm laying down this cute church sticker you know how I feel about my silver my clear stickers um, with the black writing they are my favorites and then I found this sticker from the faith sticker book that says create in me a pure heart and I think that was so pretty and then I found a binge watch sticker because on Friday we are going to do um, a little family night activity and so we're gonna binge watch a couple of shows from Netflix and um, just have a good time and then finally, I found the little grocery store sticker. Now, this is the only one that was out of um, the color scheme that I kind of set forth because if you know, the grocery store stickers are uh, brown paper bags. So I, But I still wanted to um, have that down so I'll know what day I plan on going there. But before I did that, I laid down this really cute geometric heart shape first and then I layered that one on top and I thought that was really cute. All right, you guys, that's going to wrap up the first spread of 2018. I am so excited to have this out. Um, if you didn't see me set this up again, I have a link in the description box. So go click on that so that you can see it. I love the theme of winter blues in my sugar and spice planner. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. Give this video a thumbs up. Keep God first in everything you do. Leave a comment below. I'll be happy to reply to you. Happy planning and teaching, you guys. Bye.